Keeping advertisers from tracking you through your iPhone is a lot harder than it should be. From here, where do you think you would go to turn off ad tracking? Restrictions. Wrong again. Damn. Everyone we asked outside the Apple store in Palo Alto thought you would turn off so-called ad tracking by going under the privacy settings. Where do you think ad tracking would be? I would think it'd be in privacy. It's actually not. Actually, it's buried under general, then go to about, scroll past all the technical data, and then click on advertising. And finally, turn on the button to limit ad tracking. It's very difficult to figure out. There's nothing intuitive about it. It's not very Apple-like. Tech analyst Larry Maggot says Apple has to answer to advertisers by allowing them to track specific phones and target them with ads. So burying that particular privacy setting in iOS 6, the latest operating system, is likely no accident. I do blame them. I do think that if you're going to give people the ability to control their privacy, you should make it obvious how they do it. And by hiding it and by making it obscure, it's sort of privacy denied. Is that sneaky to you? Yes, it is. Reaction among customers ranged from disbelief to apathy. I've sort of resigned myself to that's the way it is in the digital age. I don't know. They're just trying to make their money. They're trying to stay a billion dollar company. So if that's what they're going to do, that's just, I mean, I'm not going to stop buying iPhones. <laughs> in Palo Alto, Kitto, CBS 5.